today I'm going to show you how to use Vixis VR20 in the car. So first of all, we uh, insert the wireless broadband SIM card into your SIM card, the SIM card compartment. Cover it back. And then we use the uh, secret lighter adapter to provide power to VR20. So let's connect the, the, the adapter to your secret lighter. So the power is on. And then it's, it's, uh, try to search for the, the wireless network. And then the Wi-Fi also, the Wi-Fi connection also uh, created. So now we try to connect to the Wi-Fi connection created by the device. So we can, from here you can see uh, Umbra 180. This is the Wi-Fi connection from VR20. So we click connect. So we enter the profile name Enter the key that I assign Click OK So right now I'm connected to the uh, Wi-Fi connection from VR20. Now uh, let us access the uh, configuration page of VR20. Launch your internet browser enter 192.168.0.1 press enter when prompt key in admin for username and password so this is the uh, configuration page of VR20 so right now the, the connection status is connected so now we try to check whether we are connected to the internet I'll access Wix's website So we are connected to the internet. Now I'll perform an audio streaming. All our defenses. Look at us waging war. In our bed. The audio streaming quality. So now every passenger in the car can share the Wi-Fi connection. But in, however, if in the case your notebook uh, 
doesn't have Wi-Fi capability, you still can use the LAN port to connect to the LAN port of VR20. So, which means you're still able to, to, to share the connection through LAN port. 